Massive 7.6 earthquake rocks Papua New Guinea. A large crack in a highway near the town of Kainantu following a 7.6 magnitude earthquake in northern eastern Papua New Guinea on Sunday, September 11, 2022. CNN a massive 7.6 earthquake struck Papua New Guinea on Sunday, causing landslides, cracking roads, and damaging buildings. While the extent of the damage remains unclear, photos show the debris strewn across the highway and the cracks opening up on, in roads. The quake struck, struck at a depth of 90 kilometers, roughly 56 miles near. Kainantu, a town with a population of roughly 8,500 8, people, the United States Geological Survey reported. Debris lies strewn across the highway following a landslide near the town of Kainantu, following a 7.6 magnitude earthquake in northern eastern Papua New Guinea on Sunday, September 11, 2022. There have been no report of deaths and no official confirmation of the damage caused, but residents took to social media to post pictures of cracked roads, damaged cars and items falling off supermarket shelves, the Reuters reported. The U.S. National Tsunami Warning Center said there was no threat of tsunami waves. Earlier in the day, it has, it had said the hazardous. Tsunami waves that are possible within 10, 10, 1,000 kilometers, roughly 621 miles along the coast of Papua New Guinea and Indonesia. An earthquake of the similar size that hit the country's remote highlands in 2018 killed more than 60 people and wounded 500 destroying houses, causing landslides, and damaging a major gas plant. Papua New Guinea is vulnerable to earthquakes because it lies along the Ring of Fire in the Pacific Ocean, where shifting tectonic plates push across against each other, causing tremor. The ring stretches along a 25,000 miles, 40,000 kilometers ache from the boundary of the Pacific Plate to smaller plates such as the Philippine Sea Plate to the Cocos and Nazca plates that line the edge of the Pacific Ocean, each home towards the most active volcanoes, people most at risk. From volcanic eruptions and earthquakes lives in countries that lie along the Ring of Fire, including Chile, Japan, the U.S. West Coast, and other Iceland nations, including the Solomon Island to the western seaboard of North and South America. Correction. An earlier version of this story quoted the Australian Red Cross as saying at least 16 people have been killed. The Red Cross has confirmed that that toll is incorrect and related to the statement concerning a previous earthquake in Papua New Guinea that was mistakenly circulated.